Let's judge once again with a giant army of punies versus their giant army of jabbies. I wonder how long it takes to build a hive fortress. Do they have a hive mind? A lot of questions here that how they actually get that thing to spin and work. Does it work by the same way as the electricity? I don't know. I see. I, I still don't know if blowing them helps, but it looks like it does. It looks like we're winning or we're losing. I can't tell. We have 49. Oh, we won with we won by a lot. We KO'd every last Jabby here. Let's destroy the Jabby High Fortress. I, okay. Pretty sure this is just mass murder at some point. But we only knocked them out. We didn't kill them. They just fainted. This is like Pokemon. I'm just glad they finally made that noise stop. Wee 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 wee. I wonder if that's where Nintendo got the idea for our game. Gago. And so we make our move on. There's something here. That doesn't look like it's anything helpful. We can put it in. Doesn't seem to be helpful at this point in time. Let's take some of these bushes. Just in case. Uh, by the way. Uh, there was a star piece underneath the uh, on the way to the where the spiders were. I went on a shook bush and found a star piece. Sorry not to mention that, but I kind of I'm trying to. Yeah, <laughs> well, good job, Coops. So, yeah, so always shake bush. I ain't going to that one. So there's a pipe up there. We can't reach it. Our jumps are not that good. So we don't have to go away from it for now. We have another one. Uh, it doesn't seem a little bit different. I don't know. Let's put a few more over here. And maybe something will happen this time. Hmm, well, something did happen. It did happen. What? What, what just happened? Boom! That brilliant little trap! Hey, a ball! Did you point on it? I don't know what voice I used for him, so we just gotta make him Russian. He's gonna like change voices. So I made a p fake one. Also, I mean, I knew it was great, but now he's Arnold Schwarzenegger. I guess it just makes way more sense if he's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Really give me a warm fuzzy. Buh, buh, huh, huh. Talk about complete idiots. You guys are so dumb, it hurts. Anyway, with you fools out of picture, I can take my time hunting the crystal star. Buh, 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 huh, huh. You're not gonna like guard the cage or anything. No. Well, we fell into a trap. Um, what can we do? Well, I say, uh, when life gives you bars, you just go through them. You know. Let's do something before that costs four sexton. Mario, think of something! Counting on you. I re I already left. Like I'm gonna go down the pipe that randomly showed up. You know. And hit the giant butt. Oh, do we remember the rap now? You see these? I've seen. Yeah, I know. Now I remember the. Do I remember the the song? Huh? What was it? An earthquake? So we have Star Moon Bunny Star, Sun Moon Bunny Star. Sun a moon a bunny a 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 star. Sun moon. So it's Sun moon bunny a star. So it's Super Mario BS. There you go. It's Super Mario BS. If you want something else, there's the sun, the moon, the bunny, a star. Sun, the moon, the bunny, a star. Sun, the moon. Oh, oh, yeah, we're backtracking again. I think this chapter should be just called the backtracking chapter. For all we do in this chapter, it seems to be backtracking. I'm gonna go over here. Well, no, let's backtrack over here. Maybe this is why I don't like this chapter, because there's a lot of backtracking. It's annoying. You're just going from here to there to here and there. I mean, no one likes backtracking. I mean, future chapters do a little bit, but it's more for atmospheric purposes. This one, uh, doesn't really make it work. Let's see here. A sun, a moon, 
a bunny. I know they're supposed to be punies, but I looks like always look like a bunny to me. So and the paper rolls off. I'm not sure how exactly that would work. No, not the like the paper thing, but how it would keep going up a wall. But hey, not. And it's a giant treasure chest. You know, who's like a giant treasure chest? I want a giant treasure chest. And then you got some sweet shoes. And out of the middle of nowhere is Toadette. Is there, is there congratulations game the super boots these are cool kicks all the other kids with the pumped up kicks better run better run because Mario's gonna jump on your head now I I don't understand why toilets here just like you got cool shoes oh yeah you pressed it's ground pounding it's nothing new it's Mario Mario's ground pound before you're a natural nope I got it don't you turn that blush? Don't you turn that blush when she asked, said I was a natural and spin, uh, spin jump? And those panels that you see everywhere in this horn turn thing actually have a purpose! Who would have thought? They weren't just there for decoration! Let's give it a try. Basically, your, down, your jump goes up in power now. Basically, making your hammer kind of useless for the next couple chapters. When you can spin jump, you can do four damage. And also, we start a new mechanic. Hidden panels on the floor, which hide mostly star pieces, which, in my opinion, is indeed the most annoying feature they have in this game because basically it means you have to ground pound everywhere just in case you miss one. And you jump down here, and you can start platforming to get this star star sprite. I like Coop's down there trying like to platform, kind of. Oh, poof. Is there anything else over here? Ah, there's a badge. Let's get the badge. I don't know exactly what it is, but is there a panel over here? Will you spin jump? You, the panel will pop up. That's where you know you, where it is. But that's that's why I really don't like collecting all the star pieces in this game. Is because of the annoying abundance of just cheap star pieces. Just for, just like there's not a lot of indicators that it's there. Sometimes a lot of times it's just like oh well, you should know it's here. I'm like, no, I'm not gonna guess it's here. Why would I guess it's here? I love how I'm like, how many times I'm failing to land on a simple platform. <gasps> Over jump. There we go. Finally, the badge. A charge adds charge to the tactic menu, which basically means you can charge and you'll do more damage next turn, which is cool. But uh, it's nothing too special. It's just charging. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah. It's exactly. It works exactly how you would think it would. And you basically wait a turn to get more power, and then you do more power. I, I mean, it's good against if it's like a long battle, like you have a lot of enemies and you just want to charge up, and then you can do more damage through a certain amount of turns. It, it works like that, but I gotta talk about something weird on backtracking, but. I wouldn't advise it too much. Now we can get up to this warp pipe. We need to save our puny friends first. Yeah, they're all like... I'll probably go back to like being all about the orb. And... Think, you know, there has to be way out of here. I, I'm trying to... I'm trying to... I'm, tr I'm, I'm trying to save you guys. You did it! You know, we can get out of here. Well... Well... We kind of already out of here. You know, I'm not, I'm not sure what you're... Talk, I already checked the loop, which is in there. So basically, we need to blow everyone into the hole. It is, there's no better, there's no good way to phrase than that, but we have to blow everyone in the hole. So basically, actually, what you're supposed to do is put people here and then blow them down in the hole, but. And then they'll be like, oh, whoa. And then you have more people who be like, oh, whoa. And then you're like slowly trying to blow them all in the hole. It's not annoying at all. Uh, see, uh, this is a mechanic they also reuse a lot, and it never was good in the first place. But, eh, you know, it doesn't hurt to do it multiple times. And how, like, this, 
Do the punies go into the cage? How? And why is Puno stuck on the wall over there? Puno! You okay, man? Okay, Puno. You keep thinking a way to get out here, and we'll just get right back to you, okay? You you keep thinking. Have fun. Have fun. Have fun. You keep thinking. Let us know when you figure out something, because, you know... Is and basically now I gotta blow everyone into this hole, or blow people from this side as well. Blow everyone from it's not no, it's it's a puzzle. Yes, but where's the last puny? Where's the last puny? Okay, I guess those are very down here. I don't know why I told me there was one beauty, but okay. So more trudging. Now you just go back ahead. Oh yeah. Well, just to show off that Mario's in the now, Luigi's in the crowd. We also will show off the spin jump, which costs us 2 FP, which basically will make you go boom, and then boom, for 4 damage! And also, another good thing about it is that the normal jump now does 4 damage instead of just... Are you gonna pull out a potion? Drink it! That's my impression of the sound effect. Let's just show the normal jump. So now I go two. Okay, maybe we shouldn't fail the action command. But <laughs> just know, I like to get another shot here, quick. But and try to like be all cool. Oh, mushroom, that would be helpful. And let's see the timing. Yeah, great timing. Woo. Enthusiasticness for simpleness. Wish you could like like one experience point. Or mini yuck, but you just like grind mini yucks then. Mini yucks. I don't know. So, um, and. And. It would have been one, but. So now I go. And. Two. There you go. And two. Also, I was gonna throw a coin at us. Aww. So that's spin jumping. Basically, now you do more damage. With jumping. Now this boy probably feels like he goes down here. Yeah, there's no point in jumping down there. And yuck is trying to shoot at us. Yuck. I want to explore all the. You know, screw you. Ow. Oh. And then that fight. Check it. Oh, coin! Nice. I'm so glad I checked all these bushes. And I'd be like, whoa, I'm gonna check for a panel. Nope, no panel. I don't know. I feel like I have to check all the rooms now for panels. Kind of annoying. Oh, can Puny swim? No. They like they can't swim. No. Oh, I <laughs> like lose Punies. So let's go this way and see if we can drain the water somehow. I'm gonna assume that's how this works. Hey, there's one up there. That means we need to drain the water somehow. How do we lose Punies? Did you guys get really confused when we walked on the steps? Where'd they go? They walked down some steps. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you're, you're gonna be stranded for a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and raise the water temper. How did you guys get across? How did you guys make it over here? You can't jump that distance. I know this is, this is a simple puzzle. It's probably the best attempt at the puzzle we've gotten so far. I was like, hold on, I'm gonna hold this down a little bit. Yeah. And then the button pops back up, and it it. See, it's a clever puzzle. Oh, like, you could actually, I think, can also stand the other way. Yeah. And all the punies drown! I just realized they just drowned with them all. Maybe that wasn't the best call. We 
jump down here, you get a treasure chest! It's the Shrink Stop! Execute superbly to shrink foes and strap their attack power. Interesting. I mean, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's an interesting concept. No, it's 95. I have to go back up with the one that's got away. Oh, poor Coops! <laughs> I gotta go up here. Get these guys, go back down, and then go back to the other white pipe. Warp. Trump. Stump. Warp Trump. Like Donald Trump. Warp Trump. You might get something if you want to warp jump. I don't know. I doubt you would, but... I don't know. So basically, you know, all 101 punies here. I'm glad we got exactly 101. Because I'm glad, like, the Elder didn't come along for some reason. What? Oh no! What's happening? And the walls kept tumble... I actually know where there's a walls tumbling. What the heck? And the ground gave out and we tumbled down in the city and we all died horribly. Well, how'd you know this room existed? How'd you even know this room existed, then, if you didn't know how to get here? Cunies, they make no sense. But basically, next time on... Wow, I'm just doing an outro. I never do outros! Next time on Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, we have a boss, it seems, because we got a save block, and it doesn't look like we're going to go any farther down, and we got a heal block, you know what that means. Clint's clobbering time.